it's just funny to see Lil Nas X drop snippets or like legitimately good songs. That's a good song. First of all, that I love that snippet that came out where he's like detailing his experience <laughs> as a gay boy. Amazing. Vibes. It's very Yo, good. The, the, the chorus, I get it. It's simple. I it's get catchy. it. First of all, I want y'all to know that when we talk about the influence of Drake, Lil Nas X. Yeah. I heard that song like Drake would make this if, if he was gay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He, these are Drake melodies. Yeah, yeah. It is. I'm like, this is amazing yeah. music. Yeah. But, and like I, I told y'all once again before, not enough people are copying Drake, a good Drake. Yes, and that exactly. And not if you were copying good Drake. And now you see Lil Nas X doing that after that Could colossal dro- uh, fucking flop. <laughs> Holy shit, the biggest flop oh of all time. But I just honestly, if it means he's gonna drop good music, then I'm glad he flopped. By the way, people were people he he he, he quote tweeted it because people were saying now he's like uh, he's still clout chasing. He was like, Yo, this isn't what? a gimmick. He was like, this isn't a gimmick. This is really my experience now. Yeah. But also, he got to realize he painted them. I mean, can I? Can let me see if I can yeah, yeah, find yeah. a tweet. Of, uh, of him uh, talking about yeah, it. Yeah, because he said it on Twitter, and I I want I want to read his exact tweet so we can um move move from a place of facts and not a place of my memory. <laughs> you may say it's called Nazarati, by the way, which I like. Yeah, it was a good Nazarati two, which I hate when rappers do that. <clears throat> he's Nazarati one. It was it was uh, uh, it was a mixtape that had uh, the song called Titanic on it. Oh wow! I I, just, I heard it. You're a big. Like, I've, you're, I've, you you said it. You have said it. You have I'm, I've been a not before he became gay. That's great. <laughs> yeah. Um, he said, um, I hate explaining myself every time I do anything, but this is not for shock. This is me telling my story. Y'all being a comfortable by it does not make it a gimmick. This is for me and my fans. Fuck everybody else. Yeah, there was. It was actually. It was weirdly uh, uh, like. Ernest, it was a, such a sincere song when I heard, like with that snippet. Mm-hmm. You, it, you just see people only thought it's just homophobia. Like it's just people being like, "Oh my god, he's talking about he wanted dig it when seventh grade." But is it homophobia or is it like we've used to you doing shock value things? Like he's painting himself in the corner now, where you are a shock jock. You are the first shock jock. No, no, I'm not gonna say the first, but you are a shock jock rapper. Everything you do and everything you presented yourself as over the last f- three years. Is meant to be shocking. Oh my God! Yeah, I mean that's that's what I meant to say. No, you're you're right. In in that him being a shock jack has led to a lot to a to a theory that a lot of people are born into that he's not actually gay. Yeah, right. That he's doing this for show. So if you believe that he's not actually gay, and you hear that, you're gonna be like, oh, he's continuing the bit. Or even if you believe he's actually gay, like yo, why are you saying that? Are you doing too much? I don't. But I don't. I don't see how. I, I see because that cause is homophobia. I'm with well, you. No, but you to right, me, like right. I heard that said, but I'm like, there was nothing exaggerated here. <laughs> there was nothing exaggerated. It was it was just him saying, "Yo, I, I seventh grade, I needed some dick." Yo, hold on, how was that exact? That's yo. Let's. I, I like this. I let's do it. Up and go. I graduated and got out of town. Went to college where I had no one around. Grinding sessions, sexing with faceless accounts. Bringing bodies in me to sneak in the mouth. Back in middle school, I was feeling for dick. You're crazy already. <laughs> but that, but this is why I'm not, I don't see it as crazy because he is gay. So it's like at seventh and, grade, I, I wanted a girlfriend. School, but feeding for dick. But, that, but that's, he it was, he was gay. I wasn't feeding for pussy in seventh grade. Okay. I knew niggas who was fucking, but that's all the hypersexuality. That's different conversation, but let's keep going. Seven grades, and then my homies pissed. Okay, I, I hear. I hear. I do you hear see, it. It, it sounds kind of. I get. I, I get people saying, but. I, Daddy never knew what I did as a kid. So listen, let the kid go. I like that. I mean, but trust me, I get it. I get it. Trust me, I get it. That's hard. I get it. I'm with you. That's hard. Trust me, I get it. I guess I, I, I listen hard. That part, trust me. 